Hey there, and welcome to a small little demo of calendar view in filters and labels. So we are going to roll this out during this week and I'm super excited and I can just like show you how I use it and also where we are going with all this. Uh, so for some time you have been able to convert your projects into like calendar views, monthly calendar views, and now you can do the same thing for your labels or filters. So basically I have like a a snippets uh, label and I basically label everything that I really want to get done in a weekly basis and that's super critical for me and I can basically like you know hold myself accountable and really focus on like the really critical things that I want to get done during the week um, yeah so this is just one example I'm pretty sure you can come up with all kind of other workflows and examples that, that is very useful for you yeah so um, this is coming very soon and we are super excited about it and you know also another thing that, that that you can do here is like you can also filter by assignee priority label workspace uh, and this is also a new feature that, that is coming out um, yeah so exciting iteration but let me show you like where this is going um so this is kind of like a, a rock draft it's a leak uh, <laughs> and uh you know it may change but i just want to explain like and show you like how our thinking is here like what we actually want to enable you is kind of like really effective daily weekly and monthly planning and like you know giving you the tools that you can basically use to structure your weeks and days and i think this can kind of make you you know less stressed more productive and maybe a happier human being <laughs> so let's see uh and i can just like show you one of the drafts here is basically upcoming view and we really want to support the calendar view inside it so here you see like a weekly view and you will be able to kind of customize it so maybe you want to look at the whole month ahead instead of a week ahead um, so that's one aspect we also want to support some light color coding um, and maybe like we want to tie to priorities so you can really like see the p1s that you want to get done during the week or during the day another thing uh, that is also something we are iterating on is really having much better support for calendar events so basically you'll be able to see them inside a calendar um, and i think initially we will only support google calendar but maybe eventually we'll support all calendars um, yeah so this is really really exciting stuff i mean you know as a user of todoist i'm super excited uh, and i'm actually really looking forward to using this to just like better plan my week because honestly for me right now i mostly plan today and tomorrow <laughs> i don't really plan like the, the the week ahead and i think this type of like time blocking and just like visualization of the whole week or whole month is really incredible yeah so super exciting stuff thank you for watching bye bye